Yo, how's it going everybody? Welcome to today's video. I am currently playing some BFB Coliseum and I'm against just some random guy. No clue who this guy is, but we're just playing some random dude. And honestly, I was just like sitting around playing games um, and not really doing too much. Some of you guys know, and I just want to like talk about this real quick. Some of you guys know that lately, like I've been going through some shit, man. I, I, I just had my heart broken and, and you know, like li life's not too hot right now. Like I'm not gonna lie. Like I, I kind of been down a bit. But this also means, like, I, I have a funny story for you guys, and this actually just happened. Whenever, like, if, if you ever, like, been through a heartbreak before, you know that, like, lump in your chest that kind of, like, it, it, like, physically hurts, basically. And that's, like, not really motivating you to eat much. Anyway, um, my server manager in my Discord server, by the way, shout out. If you guys want to join my Discord server, link in the description, come say hi. Um, my server manager, Kev, he ordered me some food because I have not really eaten much lately and it was not good for me. I started feeling sick. So he was like really, really like nice and, and he went ahead and ordered me some food. Anyway, um, this is not where the funny story comes in though. The funny story is the guy who delivered me my food was also the guy who helped crash my car two years ago. Um, so for those who don't know, like before I did YouTube a couple years ago, I used to work part-time at a gas station and I went to school at the same time and there were a couple people who did not like me very much and one of them decided to follow me home after work one day and after I left my car and went in my apartment, they decided to smash my car and completely wreck it and I found it in the morning and it was uh, it, it was really weird um it was obviously not fun because i needed the car but whatever anyway my food just arrived like an hour ago i just ate it by the way that was hella amazing like i have barely eaten the last couple days and it just arrived and the guy who helped like smash my car it wasn't like the main villain here of the story but it was like one of them uh one of the guys who helped him smash my car, he delivered me my food, bro. And it was so weird because I opened the door and I, like, I recognized him. And, and I was like, uh, hello? And, and he was like, he, he just put the food forward, like in the bag, and he just gave it to me. And, and, and then he just said, like, uh, like, you're welcome, like, enjoy your meal, like some basic stuff like that. But, dude, like, when he walked away, I, I, like, I recognized him, I was like, yo, that's, that's actually him, what the fuck, this, this was the guy who crashed my car, what is he doing delivering me my food, what the fuck, like, I felt so freaking weird with that, like, I don't know, it was probably, like, the weirdest interaction I've ever had, because he did not look me in my eyes, like, he barely, like, he just looked down, and then he gave me my food, and then he left, I think, I don't know, maybe he, I'm, I'm pretty sure he remembers, like, no way you just forget something like that. Like, that doesn't really happen. So, like, I'm, I'm, I'm fairly certain he remembers. I'm gonna sell that. Go with the BIA. There we go. But, yeah, that, that was really weird. And I, like, got my food. I was, like, a little bit... I didn't even know, like, he still lived around here. So, I was, like, so surprised to see him. But, yeah, that, that was really, really weird. Um... And, and now, now I, I don't really know. There's not much more of a story to it other than, like, I thought it was really funny that, you know, he, he didn't really want to look at me. Uh, he, he just gave me my food and left. Uh, like, m most other people, they at least look me in the eye, you know, when they deliver me food. Not this guy. Um, but, but yeah, that was, uh, that, that, that was a weird experience that I just wanted to tell you guys about. Also, I should maybe focus on this game. I don't really know. I don't even know if my opponent is good or not. I didn't even pay attention. He doesn't look that good based on the way he's playing. So, yeah, that's just, uh, <laughs> I don't know, a little story. Hopefully you guys can, uh, can find that funny, but that's, I don't know. I don't know, I don't really know what to say about it. I should probably get up a signal flare. Oh. Eh, I probably didn't need to do that, but whatever. Let's just go for it anyway. Oh, he's actually also doing that. That's, is he gonna go for a, is he not gonna go for factory? What the hell? Anyway, now I actually knew this guy like a long time ago and, and, and then he like, he got into the wrong crowd and by the wrong crowd he got into like a friendship with the guy who helped like smash my car basically um, because he didn't like me and, uh, and, 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 and yeah, that then, yeah, now he's this like, I don't know, 
dude with tattoos walking around, you know, pretending to be a gangster while, you know, smashing other people's cars and apparently delivering me my food. But, yeah, I don't really know how to feel about it. Like, I was not certain it was him until, like, I saw him walk away and I just recognized him because he had, like, a tattoo uh, on his neck that, that I recognized. So, I was like, yep, that's definitely him. And, and that was a weird interaction. And, and now, I don't really know, man. I just started, like, continuing playing some BFB Coliseum right now, which this is hard to believe that I'm actually playing BFB Coliseum. Uh, mo mostly because my opponent does not look that good. I'm probably gonna send a BFB or like a CMG to be honest. Kind of want to get rid of this thing. Let's go for this and go for this. I have a really good eco right now, but I'm thinking I'm gonna rush with a CMG round 22. So I need to save up a little bit of money. Or actually, round 22, I could send him a rush first and then a CMG. Yeah, I think that could probably work well. I think I will. Yeah, I'll keep this over here. And I'll just send a rush, and if you boost it, I'll send him a CMG. Oh, is he rushing me too? What? Bro, what the f... Okay. This should be an easy defund, right? Why would you just all out me right here? That's dumb. Anyway, we got it. Uh, it seems. Oh yeah, I could have boosted, but all right, let's kill him. GG's, easy clap. But yeah, that's just uh, the quick. That's actually the whole reason I started recording right now was just I just wanted to tell that story. So yeah, GG. Why would he just all out me though? What was that? Come on. That's some amateur stuff right there. Anyway, I'm gonna find another opponent and uh, see if we can have some good games. Oh, this guy actually looks decent. 266 wins, 78 losses. Let's check this guy. What? He's Sloper rank 1 and Prestige rank 1? Yo, no way. Alright, I have to... We, we gotta, like, focus up a bit here. We gotta try and win this. I gotta try hard. I definitely gotta try hard. He's Sloper rank 1 and Prestige rank 1, bro. Okay, let's go, dude. Snowfall. How do I want to play on Snowfall? Probably... Honestly, probably want to play Copra on this map, I think. I think this is probably... I don't know. I like Copra. Let's play for it. He might go DFA, though. I don't know. He might also go an Acro Strat. I did not expect to be paired up with the number one global and prestige player. Like, bro, what is my luck? Uh... Alright, number one rank, at least. Doesn't mean he's number one in skill. I think right now of active players, that's probably Brian Chess, to be honest. Currently. Like, I don't know who, uh, who else still plays that are really good. Alright, let's get these two up. He goes for a spike and a farm. Wait, he's most likely going DFA. Okay, I gotta focus up a bit here. I'm gonna go for another wired fund in a sec yeah he goes for that there we go 25 seconds let's go we anti-stall he does not get that much money i'll take it i gotta go for the bomb at uh, 42 seconds i can send to 261 and then i can go for the bomb i think is correct maybe please wait did i oversend i oversend i could have only sent to 260 oh my god i'm a dumbass bro i have to wait a lot more all right go for this here Targeted. Okay, it's not too bad. It could have been worse. Wait, he's going for attack. Wait, does he have attack mortar? No way. Wait, if he goes attack mortar, he might actually be able to counter. But the thing is, I'm planning on going late anyway. Unless he has attack sup, which I don't know how I wanna how I wanna play against. I'm gonna go for this though. I'm gonna put this on close. I'm expecting him to be aggressive because he has tag. It doesn't look like. Oh, there he goes. All right, let's just go for this. We should be, uh, we should be okay with the 2-0 bomb. I can also go for another Cobra in a bit. I think I'm gonna do that. I definitely want to prioritize Eco mostly here, because I think he can easily defend adjustments. So I don't think adjustments are actually that good to do, or, like, good to send. He says, well done. I'm just gonna say well done as well. Why not? We'll see who wins this. It's gonna be, it's gonna be an interesting game. Although, if he has Tag Mortar, he can counter my Cobra, but... Bomb is still going to be really good late game. So, like, as long as I don't give up at, like, 600 eco. If, if, if I just continue on ecoing a lot, I will probably have a... 
I'll probably have like a pretty solid chance, I think, of defending. All right, 411 eco. So far, so good. And we're not completely anti-stalling. He's probably gonna try and go for BIA. Like, I can't really imagine him doing anything less. Why would you go for another tag? You actually don't really need that, I don't think. I think he's solid with one tag for now. Unless I start sending him blacks, then maybe not. Alright, I need to go for the cluster now, just because he's sending me black balloons, so... I'm gonna send this, I think that's... I could probably send one more red. Yeah, here we go. Alright, let's spike this, just so we don't leak too much. And then just continue on ecoing. Our eco's looking solid right now, 510. I'll take it. I'm curious to see, I think he probably has sub. But he could also have mortar. Like, it's gotta be either sub or mortar. I can't really imagine him having anything else. Oh, what is he doing? He just boosted that? Okay, I'm gonna say well done. What the hell was that? Buddy. Holy, alright, let's boost these at him. We gotta get a lot going right now. Yeah, he'll be fine to that. But we forced some more defense, so I'll take it. And right here, I am thinking of getting a sub down. Of course, we want to send him a lead. But we gotta get this down right here. And of course, I want to upgrade it as well. Uh, am I good here? Please be. Uh, I'm fine. It's okay. I'm um, alright, I think. Let's put this on close. Just because we would actually uh, struggle against that. Yo, he has wizard. Wait, we should be able to win this then. I'm gonna go for a bit more eco though. There we go. I'm gonna go for 650 and then I'm gonna stop. I think if he tries to all-out rush me here, I can probably easily sell this and get up a bomb and defend. If he all-out rushes me. I think with this, with a boost, I'll probably be okay. Yeah, I'm okay with a boost. If he all-outs me again, I'll just legit sell everything and go for a bomb and I'll be fine. He's not getting up a BIA now. He completely ruined that for himself, so I think I'm solid here. I'm just going to continue on going for this. I also know that he can't adjust me, so I actually don't really need to worry that much. All I need to do is just, like, go for a bunch of Cobras and I'll be fine. I should be able to beat this guy, I think. Like, chances for me are really solid. And he's, like, the number one ranked dude, so... I mean, why not? He's gonna target this too strong. Of course, like, he could try and send me some stuff, but I honestly think I'll be, like, more than fine with my current defense. Yeah, that's not gonna do anything. I'm just gonna say, well done. Like, I'll easily just hack these up. Like, that that did nothing. That was just a waste of money, to be honest. Like, $660 per camel ceramic. And he sent two of them. Like, that, that completely just did nothing. That was, like, a waste of over a thousand bucks. I think this right here is probably solid, and then we want to start adjusting him. I think that's going to be the play here pretty uh, pretty soon. I do want to go for the bomb tower here just because of a Moab. He could send me one, and of course we will have to be a little careful of that. Is he going to go for BIA now? Oh, he goes for bang. Okay. Oh, he does go for BIA. Okay. Alright, buddy, I'm gonna give him a thumbs up here, and then we're just gonna start adjusting. I wanna send a... what's it called? Yeah, I think he's dead here. Are you dead, dude? Not yet. He's gonna have to boost, I think. Boost, buddy. You're dead. 14 lives. Is he good? 9 lives. Alright, let's just keep on adjusting. Yeah, he's gonna struggle a lot here. He might try and send me a BFB. In which case, I'll probably just redirect it, I think. But I actually think he'll die before he gets to send me a BFB. Like, he's gonna have to sell his BIA soon. He's also down a boost. Yeah, he sells his BIA. And he goes down, GG. Look at that. We beat the number one ranked player. This guy is global rank one and prestige rank one. Good game. And he doesn't want to rematch me. Okay. What did you expect? Anyway, let's, uh, let's try and go for one more game. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't find the same guy. I was kind of hoping, you know, that, that would have been fun. But let's uh, let's see what uh, magic we can make happen here. Battle Sands, of course, this is another Cobra map, so of course we're going to go Cobra here. But let's say good luck to uh, Mr. Try New Stuff. Let's say hi and let's get right into it. Alright, so he skipped the maps. Looks like we're playing on Shipwreck, but that is also fine. I'm going to spike the end here. 
and then I think I'll probably be satisfied with a Buccaneer, like, uh, over here seems good. Yeah, there we go. Of course, I want to install the first round just so we can start ecoing sooner. I'm expecting him to go eco as well, because you can't really farm on this map. Not properly, at least. Anyway, let's go for 1-1. One, one. Targeted to close, I think, is solid here. I think close here should work pretty well, I hope. Yeah, probably. And then we just want to eco. And I'm going to go, since we are going sniper right now, I'm probably going to go 550 eco. And then I do want to see if I can like take him out early to like a BFB or something. If he goes sniper as well, because a lot of people actually struggle to a BFB. Um, so, you know, it, it might be possible, but we'll, we'll, we'll see. Anyway, round three is just about to come to an end. There we go. Switch over to some blue balloons. And it looks like it is kind of being anti-stalled a little bit. Uh, because the rounds are ending sooner than, uh, than, you know, what is good. So, uh, no nothing really much we can do here. We all, all we gotta do is just defend to the best of our ability while, uh, still ecoing. I might go for another Buccaneer soon, though. I think this one right now is actually doing me justice. Like, it's, it's, it's doing pretty well in just defending the regular Bloom Blooms. But I'll probably get another one, like, over here or something like that, uh, before round six. He goes for now. I think I'll go for now as well. Why not? There we go. Hopefully we can be fine to uh, to a green balloon rush. He actually goes for the zero one one already, which I think is a little too early, just because now he's just losing out on a bunch of eco. So that's probably not the play. Yeah, probably not. Anyway, I'm not going to go for the zero one one quite yet. I do want to focus a little bit more on... Getting a little more eco if I can get away with it. Okay, but now I should probably slowly start to consider it. I'm going to target this two first. Back on close, get up another grape shot, and we should be okay here. At least I know that I'm out ecoing him, which is solid. Just because uh, we got some more eco going when he wasn't. So we got a little bit of a lead, but we did sacrifice a couple lives for it. So, you know, that's fine. Right, here we go. I'm gonna go 550 and then I'm gonna stop there. There we go. Alright, beautiful. And now he's of course gonna send a bunch of yellows. I'm just gonna go for faster shooting. I don't wanna boost this if I can like not. Let's target this to first. Go for this over here. Okay, he's being very aggressive. I'm gonna need to boost that. He's over ecoing a lot, but. I'm gonna sell this now, go for my sniper, I'm just gonna go for it here. Okay, he goes for wizard, that kinda explains it. If he has wizard, then I can't really, like, all out him or anything like that. Um, I don't think so, not a, not yet at least. I don't know what he has, but if we we're going late, like, I, my strategy probably should win. And he continues on, e if he continues ecoing like this, like, I will, I'm just gonna, like, all out him. Oof, am I good here? Holy shit, five lives, bro, are you kidding me? He just says hi. I will have to defend uh, the all-out rush he's just about to send me. I'm gonna go for this now. And I need to go for this on strong as well, in case he wants to all-out me. He just did send a big rush, so I need to go for the 2-3 sniper. Doesn't look like he wants to all-out me. Can I even all-out him? Is that possible? I wonder. Okay, we force a boost. Maybe I can all out him right now. He says, oops. He over e way too much. I think we can just all out him and call it a GG. He goes for a glue gunner. Interesting. I think he's dead here. Let's give him a thumbs up. Is he anti-stalling me? What is he doing? Okay, we take the win. Oof, GG. He tried, though. There was an attempt, but he over e way too much. He greeted, bro. I'm going to facepalm that. Check him out. Global rank zero. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, do be sure to go down and hit that subscribe button. I'd appreciate it. Peace out.